All right, so I'm going to create a lead gen campaign for a client in Nextdoor. It's a brand new offer. I've never really done this before, so we're going to go through this together. So I'm going to create campaign. I'm going to title this lead gen. I'm going to choose lead gen. Qualified leads and calls. So let's see what happens next. I'm going to call this lead gen again, May zip codes. Uh, this client has zip codes already. All right, I guess we're good there. Okay, so I changed my mind. I wanted to only target these specific zip codes. So we're going to test with this because we're also running lead gen on Facebook and I want to test the differences. So um, we're going to leave it to, let's do some home ownership to 76% to 100% homeowners. Um, and 51% to 75% home ownership. Let's do that. Uh, daily goal I despise is $1,000. Um, placeholder. It's very annoying. Um, okay, so let's set the date and time below. You can only run this on newsfeed, which is interesting. So this will run for a month. Okay, perfect. So. All right, so here is the artwork that we are going to upload. You just schedule a coach. Information I want to gather, full name, phone number. Um, I should also ask for zip code. Okay. Oh, that's already there. All right, we'll delete that and we'll do it like this. I wish I could rearrange these now that I've already done it, but I can't. So we're just gonna roll with it. Really hope that it's like more, okay, good. Okay, I need a quote, replace repair. Okay, zip code. It looks like they're automatically gonna fill that in, so that could be interesting. Um, okay, so limitation here kind of stinks, but whatever. Um, for success, I'm going to say thank you. A Member from our team will. Oh, I'll just say thank you. We will contact you. I'll contact you shoot, soon. To no, I guess we'll contact you soon. Um. Oh wait, thank you. I guess if we just say thank you. So I really would like to say like you can exit the form or visit our website, but whatever, we'll just put uh, view website. So here we go. Hit next. All right. And I guess we will publish. I have no idea where these leads are going to go. <laughs> so that's going to be interesting. Um, yeah, 
I guess I'll keep everybody posted. Stay tuned. Hey guys, so I just wanted to, you know, let you know where we are with this campaign. I just finished editing this video um, and thought, well, let me just pop in here and see if we've gotten any leads, and we have not. I'm mostly concerned because I have no idea where these leads are going to go. Am I going to get like a random notification in here that there's a lead? Um, how can I contact this person? I have no idea. So I'm just waiting for that lead to come through before we kind of take it to the next stage. So I'm just waiting right now. I am running an exact test here with also Facebook leads and Facebook has already generated a lead. So that's kind of where we're at with this. Remember in this case for lead gen, like we want people to fill out the form. So we're looking for form submissions. This isn't the end all be all though when it comes to lead generation. Um, you know, there's a couple different ways you can do it, like brand awareness, engagement, traffic to the website, and then retargeting. Like there's a lot of different ways you can create leads. I just really wanted to test this form and um, you know, see how it goes. I'm going to be testing it with another client that has a little bit more of a healthier budget and they have tremendous success with lead form ads on Facebook. So I'll be applying it directly here and see how it works um, for them on Nextdoor. So stay tuned for that video. Maybe I'll do another like how to video with that because this first one was very rough. It was literally my first time running through it. And while I was editing it, I was like, well, this is rough. But you know, you got to see firsthand me going through an account for the very first time. So I'll keep you posted. I'll run a couple more videos and we'll take it from there. Adios.